subscribe now. EU debates. Let me just remind you that the ECB does not take a stance on political matters. Political matters are for the democratic process of each and every member state. And that is certainly the case for the country that uh, you're referring to. Differences in local financing can legitimately arise, among others due to the country's specific macroeconomic landscape. And that has happened in the past. So, the Governing Council will make the assessment of whether, of whether a country meets the eligibility criteria or not at the time when it has to make those determinations. And it will do so having a, 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 a sort of threefold uh, assessment, if you will. First of all, it will determine a comprehensive assessment of market and transmission indicators. There's a whole range of such indicators. Second, it will at that time evaluate the eligibility criteria. And third, and that's very important, it will have to make a judgment call that activation of purchases under the TPI is proportionate to the achievement of the ECB primary objective. Now, those of you who are familiar with the legal requirements and with the concept of proportionality will have understood what I mean by that, but this is obviously operational in relation to any activation decision that uh, is, being is being made. Thank you, President. 